First off, there are two things you're probably wondering. One, why no recent vlog? Well, that's because, like I said in the last one, I think, um, the Wi-Fi on the ship is crap. And it's like that on a lot of ships. I've got a friend who works with Norwegian Cruise Lines, and she told me that it's near impossible to get Wi-Fi. My, my friend Craig, uh, he, he said the same thing. And I'll, I'll try to post them as best I can, Like, but please keep in mind, this job is pretty demanding, and free time, especially free time for internet and YouTube, is almost a joke. I mean, I was in Fort Lauderdale today, but I didn't have any time because I had a drill later today. And the second thing you're probably wondering is, what is this? Well, I had some, sorry to say, acting to do today. Um, it's the first day of the new voyage, and for the most part, well, most of the time, all the time, the photographers and the videographers shoot um, the uh, new passengers in a pirate theme. And me and my friend Gabriel, who's who joined the same day as me, and even more ironically, is the same height as me, uh, we both had to dress up as pirates, and it was a lot of fun. It was near impossible for us to laugh. Actually, when I had to put on my pirate wig, combined with this, I actually looked like General Turl from Battlefield Earth. Uh, for those of you that don't know what Battlefield Earth is, thank God, but for those of you who do know what Battlefield Earth is, it's considered probably the worst science fiction film ever made. And Turl is basically this crazy, very stupid alien guy that wants to get all the gold from Earth. And I did try to do a, a depression of him uh, when there weren't any passengers who wanted a photo. So basically I just went, well, you was to learn to spell your name. <laughs> uh, honest to God, I, uh, uh, it's really hard to do any of John Travolta's lines from that movie, the guy who plays Turl. And not laugh your ass off. It's impossible. Uh, it, it took me weeks to say those lines <gasps> without, without laughing halfway through. Um, so what, what's happened since the last time I posted a vlog? Um, um, went through the canal again. That was a lot of fun. Shot in Cartagena. And that was a lot of fun too. Um, actually, the edit for this one... The one I did, I thought was really, really good. And I, I, I don't want to sound pompous in any way, because, frankly, I, everyone's work needs adjustment. Um, but, yeah, this one was really good. I got to tour through the old city, and the colors in, in Cartagena, well, the old city at least, are unbelievable. I mean, they, they are just breathtaking to look at in the old city, and the culture is amazing. The artwork you see in the city, the sculptures, the, the designs, wow. Um, South, South America is, this is the only place in South America I've been to so far, is really, really nice. And we also visited um, the old cathedral, and even though I'm not very, a very religious person in there, the um, I really do appreciate uh, the structure and the artwork in this place cathedral because it is amazing and when i found the right music for it and for my edit uh it just almost felt like something out of um i'm trying to think uh the ave maria from uh, disney's fantasia and that's prop that teamed up with nine on ball mountain is probably my favorite film of all time but um I'm, why am i talking about movies so much movies i love movies i hate uh, i i don't know but uh anyway uh, that that was a lot of fun i also um Went to the animal sanctuaries in Le Mans, and that was a lot of fun, too. Um, got to um, hold a baby monkey, and this little guy was unbelievably cute. I was told that uh, his mother was killed uh, by a wild dog, and when I look into in, in Le Mans, I notice that there are a lot of wild dogs there, and that really is a shame because they've got all these shelters for and all these habitats for all the wild animals there but a dog shelter because i've been told that a lot of dogs kill some of the monkeys that live there that could really up the monkey population or at least keep it more stable if they built a a dog shelter like the ones we have back in canada because 
the better you can control the species or help all the species, the better. Um, where else have I went to recently? Um, went back to Aruba. Yes, I was in Aruba um, a few days ago. And that was a lot of fun. I uh, love that island. But it does feel a lot like a desert there. Um, last time I was there, uh, it was at night when I b got off my flight. So I didn't really have much time to look around. And I really didn't pay much attention to Aruba when uh, I was on my way to the ship. But, yeah, it's, it's a really nice city. A really nice island. It's, it's really small. It's just off the coast of Venezuela. Um, and I will also notice that Aruba, compared to the other places I've been to so far, uh, Aruba definitely feels the most relaxed compared to Cartagena, the newer, the modern Cartagena, and, I'm sorry, and especially Le Mans. Le Mans, everywhere you look in Le Mans, there's always bars, there's always wired fences, it's pretty much a very secured area, whereas Aruba, there's barely any of that. I mean, I may have seen one really secured area, but that that's, that's a pretty ch chilled island. They don't worry too much about anything there. I mean, the people are unbelievably nice. I mean, hmm. And what else is I going to talk about? Um, hmm. Yeah, another great shoot through the canal last week. Um, we're getting closer and closer to the really big uh, shoot of the canal in May, where we're literally going right through all the locks, straight through the Pacific Ocean, where then we sail more north, 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 until eventually we reach Vancouver. And I can't wait for Vancouver and just to get some uh, Molson Canadian, get some Canadian beer, because the beer, the beer on this ship is good. I, I had some Blue Moon the other night, my uh, friend Phil, who's from England, he, he thought it was Canadian beer, but I recently found out it's from Colorado. <laughs> So, it's like that uh, Paps Blue Ribbon from uh, South Park. You know, white trash, eat trouble. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that was, um, it was okay. It felt a little flat, but it wasn't that awful compared to other American beers I've had. Um, I've also had Tostecchi's. Stay thirsty, my friends. That is a really, really good beer. It's got a great taste to it and a great flavor. And I've also had this Dutch beer, uh, he Heinex. It's got a little star on it. I, I can't pronounce that one right. But uh, that was not as good as Tostecchi's, but still pretty good. And, hmm, what else? Um, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm always thinking these things through. Um, what else? Um, hmm. Give me a second. Happy birthday, Dad, and happy birthday, Reagan. As I'm recording this, it is April 17th, so happy birthday, Dad. Happy birthday, Regan. I hope you enjoyed the cards I left you before uh, I left, and especially you, Dad. I'm, I'm, I'm sure you'd like that one. Um, hmm. Yeah, things are going along pretty good now. I mean, the first week was... Wow, this is a lot to absorb. Uh, week two, a um, little bit better. Week three one is was really, really good. Uh, all my team is super, super nice and super helpful, and we're pretty much all friends now. And uh, my supervisor, Ben, he's really smart, and he's really nice, and he's pretty much seen as many movies as I have, and he's even seen The Room. And uh, this is for Matt and Jeff. Uh, guys, um... I managed to get a copy of The Room, so when I'm back uh, home in Ontario in September, uh, we're all going to watch it together. And like I said before, um, once you watch this movie, there's no going back. You will be trapped in the room forever. <laughs> <gasps> no, but really, you, you, you can't escape that movie. It's impossible. So guys, uh, that's it for now. Sorry I haven't posted as many vlogs as I hope, but... Things are pretty busy right now. Uh, hopefully I'll have something new to post by the time we uh, reach the next canal run. Like like I said, I'm going to try to post these as often as I can. But YouTube's crap on this ship. I don't have much time in ports. And if I'm in Fort Lauderdale, I'll be in Fort La Lauderdale next week. 
So maybe by then I'll have a window of opportunity to just post them. I'll try my best. I'm not making any solid promises, but I will try my best. Okay, everyone. See, I'll see you. Um, well, I don't know when I'll see you, but anyways, wish me luck. I hope you're all doing well. I hope all my friends in Canada, all my family in Canada are doing well. And I promise to return with a lot of good stories. And uh, happy birthday, Dad. Happy birthday, Rig. Um, hope Tuck's doing okay. I miss you, little buddy. And so long, everyone. May the force be with you.